Uh, Craig Calla, supporters of this plan say it is going to pay off with cleaner air, transit upgrades, as well as making everything work a bit better with traffic on the streets, too. But those who are against are saying not so fast, even as the U.S. Department of Transportation confirms the wheels are now turning towards them, finalizing this now revised cheaper toll. It's official. Governor Kathy Hochul confirming a new $9 toll for most vehicles driving below Manhattan 60th Street, down from the initial $15 charge. A cost-cutting move she says will save commuters money and still allow for much-needed transit improvements. Safeguarding the long-term viability of our subway and commuter rails, the safety of our streets, the health of our environment, and the strength of our economy, these are all hard to do but they're necessary. Over time, Hochul says those tolls will raise billions for transit projects, including adding elevators and extending the 2nd Avenue subway line and boosting outer borough bus service. The plan also expected to cut traffic south of 60th Street by 13%. The toll can still be raised, but Hochul says she prefers waiting at least three years. Everybody being tight on money these days. Um, I'm commuting in from Long Island and have to pay for MTA Easy Pass and everything adds up. Yep. Definitely not in favor for it. I think that it's necessary, you know, ambulances are sitting on Fifth Avenue trying to get to patients and it's crazy. Congestion pricing, though, still facing scrutiny on all sides, from legal challenges to bipartisan blowback in Congress. Already, five New York House Republicans are asking President-elect Trump to stop the plan. New Jersey House Democrat Josh Gottheimer also opposed. You can't whack hardworking families uh, with a new tax. It's already a fortune to commute to New York and to drive into New York. It's too much. And back live, even though the gantries and gear are all set up, New Jersey Governor Phil Murphy is asking Governor Hochul to reconsider and also urging all lawmakers to speak out against this as his office now wages a court fight to block this toll from ever going forward. Meantime, Governor Hochul is working towards the January 5th start date to roll out these new tolls. That is just weeks before President-elect Trump is said to be sworn in office, and Trump has been quite vocal about his opposition to this toll. We are live now in the Upper East Side. Justin Finch, Pix 11 News, back inside to you.